this one is about my little nephew that passed away in December. Uh, he was only about 12 days old, so I never got a chance to see him. And I wrote this one about him. I woke up this morning feeling something different, thinking about my nephew and if he knew I existed, so that he know there was weight that I lifted. I always felt as if I was cursed, but man, he was gifted. Woke up this morning feeling something new in the back of my mind, wondered if he knew that I'm his uncle and he's my nephew. Wasn't there to see him alive, damn. How bad am I? I'm a fucked up uncle to go see my nephew in a baby suit and tie. All, all day, all I could ask was why. Sat alone in the car just to cry. Got to the point where I even thought of suicide. Hold on. Suicide? How sick am I? That's against my belief. I'm a Christian Christ. That's something that should never even cross my mind. But still, all in due time, my wounds were healed. Even though he's gone, his tattoo still, his hair placed on the back of my neck above the angel wings with all due respect. I got him there placed on my back to make up for all that I lack. Because truthfully speaking, I should have fell into hell with a straight splat. Because Lord knows I've done some evil things like premarital intercourse, you know, sex without a ring. Should I've done it so many times, most of which without a wink. I really mean better than I. My mistake, I'm sorry. I'm a, I'm a, ha! I'm allowed at least one fuck up, right? Without involving the homeboy Maury. Nothing ever bothers me. <laughs> Shit. Nothing ever will. Except that I never saw my nephew while he was ill. Because now when I wake up in the morning, something's forever born. My little nigga, my dude, my first nephew born. That was, this one I know by heart. This is a new one. I don't know how many of y'all Jay-Z fans out there. Let me see your hand. Right here. All right. All right. Um, on his last album, he had a song called Beach Chair. If you know it, you know how the flow goes. All right. Life is but a dream to me, but all I have are nightmares. It's sad to think one night I almost lost my life here. So I'm going to say this right here. I can't make my mom tear. I got to live my life right. Yeah. Went from being damn near broke to almost having every clothes. To hear my angel singing to me. Are you happy, D? I just hope I'm hearing right. Karma's got me feeling like, Nicholas, are you praying for me? See, what happy you don't know is what goes on in my mind. There's a gap between life and death. So just to pass the time, I think of little things like committing suicide. Thinking to myself, would anyone really care that me cutting my wrist with me, me not being here, the doctors touched my mom, got her pulling out her hair, shows her the x-ray in reference to me. Show, tells her there's no chance that I hit an artery. And just as my mom walks away, he tugs about her sleeve and whispers in her ear, his life is but a dream. <laughs>